Hi, this is Pat Love with Pat's Two Cents. I know I've been off the scene for a while and off screen. While I haven't been abandoning my post, I'm in the process of finishing my kitchen. I have to grout my mother of pearl on the wall, my mother of pearl backsplash, and my mother of pearl tabletop. And then I have to finish putting in the details of my of the base of the table. And uh, when I am pretty much done, I will take you on a tour. But I just wanted to share with you, a lot of you think that, uh, that I'm gone. A lot of you think that I have taken a long break. No, I was just sick last week, but I want to share this with you. I'm getting a lot of feedback that people are not getting notifications. When I call them and ask them, because a lot of, you know, some of my YouTube family, you know, they became church members online. And I asked them, I said, did you get my, my video? Did you see the so-and-so video yet? And they'll say, I never even got a notification. And they've been subscribed for years. And some of them have been saying, I'm not even subscribed anymore, but I never stopped it. So YouTube is stopping and canceling out a lot of subscriptions. I don't know why. Part of it is, this is what I believe. This is me ranting for a while, so allow me to rant or vent. I believe that because I unmonetize my channel, YouTube can't even make money. Now, here's the reason I unmonetize. Years ago, when I tried the monetization, after about two years, every time I looked around, they YouTube started nitpicking at little nuances of the of the videos, and they would say, "Oh, oh, because of your sensitive content, we can't uh, monetize your channel. We have to demonetize. We have to do this. We have to do that." Now I was in good standing the whole time. I've never been out of good standing. So what I did was I went through all 1,000 of my videos and unmonetized every single one individually. Then I unmonetized my whole channel. Now, after that, people started noticing that they haven't seen me that much. They haven't been getting notifications. Why? Because if YouTube doesn't get ads, on your channel, even though they see it, if you get ads, they want to say what you can and what you cannot do. That's the comical part because their hand is in your pocket. But when you get the hand out of your pocket, you take away control. And when you take away control, they don't like it. Number one, they don't get control of you. Number two, they don't get control of the money coming through because ain't none coming through. So now, they decide, okay, we'll steal your views. The views just keep dropping and dropping. And next thing you know, you may have started with this amount of views. And then later on that day, instead of having more, you have less. Weird. And another thing they'll do, they'll stop people's subscriptions. They won't, they won't allow them to be notified. So all the algorithms and all that other stuff has nothing to do with it. It's about money and control. Now, I'm not indicting. I am saying that is what my suspicion of YouTube is. That's what my take on it is. That if they don't have money, if they don't get money and they don't have control, they're going to blackball your video so bad that no matter how hard you try, barely anybody's going to know. One of my friends told me they saw one of my videos I had uploaded a day prior. This was about three weeks ago. And they said, you know, when I looked at your video, it said no views in the suggestion box, in the suggestion list. <coughs> it had the title, had your picture, but it said no views. I clicked on the video and it said, you had a number of views on there. <coughs> I forgot whether it was over 100 or under 100, but she said, why didn't they say that you had views? It looks like nobody's watching your videos. Right. So it's what my favorite word is sabotage. So I say this to you guys. It's very disheartening to work so hard, do so many hours. You're already not getting paid. 
And then to do that and have somebody steadily ripping the carpet out from under you. You drive 30 miles and somebody backs you up 25. All that time, all that effort. I ask you guys to go back over my videos and replay some of them. Go back and reach back to 1,700 worth of videos. There may be some videos you never even knew I uploaded. Just check them out. See what's on my channel. There are almost 70 <coughs> different playlists from shooting pool to movies to worship and praise, international worship and praise, salsa worship, mensajes españoles, that's Spanish sermons. All kind of stuff is on there. Sign language, ASL sermons, ASL worship, all kind of stuff. Check it out. I, I spent days, hours, weeks, months, years building up this channel only to watch YouTube chipping away at it so it almost falls flat. Last year, every single day, every single day when I only had 2,000 subscribers, I was averaging 1,000 views every single day on the whole channel. Now it looks like they don't even count the views that you get on all those playlists. So if I'm just getting the views from my, from my personal videos and they're not counting all the rest, that undermines it as well. Before, we used to get all the views. So so much for all those playlists. Now I'm averaging two or 300 total views a day with 3,300 and something subscribers. And uh, I'm about what? Uh, 150 or 200 away from 700,000 views total. But even though I'm growing, it looks like I'm shrinking. And I must tell you, you guys, it's very frustrating. It's very frustrating. And I have to fight the urge to just give up and just forget it. Because I want people to see the views. I'm not doing the views to sit up on a, on a desk and collect dust. Because that's what it feels like. You put in all this work and it, somebody, stuck the, you, somebody stuck all your work in the back drawer somewhere. So nobody would see it. That's the way it feels. Anyway, now that I have ranted and vented, <clears throat> I will start getting busy again. But I had to wait till I got over that bug because that thing had me wiped out. As soon as I came back from Pasadena, boy, I'm telling you, I got hit by a bug and it, it laid me flat. So I will get busy. I just want to kind of let you know what's going on because I do believe in accountability. And it doesn't look good when people just disappear and there's no explanation. I think everybody deserves more respect and appreciation than that. So I'm explaining why I haven't been around. But I hope that you think to take some time and go back. There's a whole lot of videos. Many of you probably didn't even know I was making. One person actually messaged me and said, welcome back. And I was like, welcome back from where? And they said, oh, you've been gone for over a year. Hmm, isn't that crazy? Now, I'm not criticizing the person that thought that. That's YouTube's fault. I hadn't gone anywhere. I've been steadily doing videos. They had no idea I was still around. How many more people are like that? Anyway, y'all, especially us Christians, we know that there's a sabotage going on. So I ask you for added help. Many of you have the ability to make playlists out of my videos. Many of you have the ability to share my videos through your email, just blast it through your thousands of email recipients, people who know you. Send them, please. I need help. Some of you have big channels, 2 million, 3 million, and you do Christian videos. Give me a shout out. I need help because everything's working against me on YouTube. I need to have some brothers and sisters helping work for me. God bless you, and I really appreciate it.